Hey Style Sisters, welcome to Sanctuary of Style. As promised, I've got a few new spring webisodes and today's topic is something that got really hot a few years ago and I was never really into it. It was a little too girly, but over the past few seasons it just keeps getting hotter and hotter and this season it is just all over the place and I am officially a lace addict. <laughs> yes. So obviously that's what we're talking about today. And the thing I love about lace is it does bring out a feminine side to us and, and it, it can be worn really girly and feminine. And it can also be worn pretty edgy and rocker, which is what I usually lean towards. So today I'm just going to show you a few different ways that I've started wearing lace and I think no matter what your style is, we can all add a bit of lace to our wardrobe this season. Let's talk about the outfit I'm wearing. Outfit number one is this great blouse. It has a beautiful collar, which I call a Victorian collar. I don't know what the real official name for it, but I do know it's hot this spring. It's got these beautiful sleeves, and this blouse did come without a camisole. So if you are going to buy lace, and you buy a dress or a blouse that comes just as is with no camisole underneath, make sure to invest in a great black camisole. I think if you wear nude under this, it could look a little risque. I mean, people would be looking at you thinking, has she got anything on under there? Uh, so get a black camisole. I've got a great pair of basic slacks. They flare at the bottom, pretty tailored, uh, black patent skinny belt, and that's it. This is a great go-to outfit for a date, for any kind of occasion that happens in the evening. And I'm going to throw on a vest and show you a different way to wear it. Uh, I mean, do we even really need to talk about this? To me, this is perfection. I love the menswear look and this outfit fits just about every category. It's chic, it's sophisticated, it's feminine, it's tailored, it's, uh, what else, uh, a little edgy. I love it, and depending on where you work, you might be able to get away with this at the office. All I did was unbutton the collar, throw on a vest, voila, love it. Outfit number two is for those of you who may not be into the full-on lace. You may just want a hint of it, like this cut-out lace, I guess you would call it a cut-out. You'll see it everywhere. This is by Katherine Malandrino. She has perfected this look. She has the most gorgeous blouses and dresses. And I've paired it with a simple black pencil skirt. This really should have been one of my 15 must-haves, the video I did a few years ago. But um, I'm not really a skirt girl, but we should all have a great black pencil skirt in our wardrobe. Now the last few outfits are just dresses, so I'm going to breeze through those pretty quickly. Let's talk about colored lace. I love this dress, and the blue is really hot for spring. And a really important tip I want to bring up about colored lace, ladies, is that it can look very cheap. I mean, think about red lace, the Valentine's boxes that have lace on them. Uh, how cheesy, right? So just make sure if you're going to do colored lace, and I really highly recommend that you do because there's some beautiful things out there in the pastels, the mint green, the lavender, coral, things like that, but just make sure that it's good quality. Otherwise, it's just going to look really, really cheap and you don't want that. Now for my final outfit, I pulled out a tunic I've had for a few years and this color is really hard to wear and I really should be tan for it, but I wanted to show you how great it looks to mix the rocker pieces, the heavier metals with the feminine lace. I chose the gunmetal belt and to lighten things up a bit, I chose gunmetal leggings as well instead of the black that we've been living in all winter. But how great does the lace look with the, the rocker pieces? I just love it. I hope you are in love with lace now as much as I am and remember it's all over the stores right now so whether you want to do a full-on lace dress like my blue one or just a splash I've seen great tops with just like a little hint on the shoulder and 
keep on giving me feedback ladies I love your comments you've been saying you want to see more outfits and how I pair things so I'm gonna be doing that more and more in my webisodes follow me on Pinterest and Twitter and I would love for you to join my blog sanctuaryofstyle.net I tend to open up and share about more deep issues there and also join the Facebook community the ladies there rock I love you girls. It's spring, so I know a lot of you are starting your spring cleaning, so make sure to check out my video on closet organization. I give you some tips and a strategy for shopping on a budget. I want to thank all of you from the bottom of my heart for sharing my videos, you're tweeting my posts, because I'm building SOS on my own. I've started it, created it, and I'm growing it on my own, so all of your support means the world to me really each and every retweet comment everything just uh it's very very special to me so i want you to know that okay thanks for watching i will see you on the next episode